You want to tell her? I, I moved out. We're that separated. Just... That's right. 90 Day Fiance stars Colt and Vanessa have split. So you two are separated now. You're not living together. She's having to live with us for three weeks. During the 90 Day The Single Life Tell All special, the married couple reveal they are no longer living together and why, in a shocking twist involving Colt's mom, Debbie. I'm, I'm upset that you just can't do anything by yourself. I'm the first person, the first call, the first everything with you. Not anymore. I just feel very smothered because you're constantly in Colt's face. If I need him, you're in his face. It's nonstop. Hey, Cole, hey, Cole, even if our door is closed at the room. Hey, Cole, hey, Cole, it's nonstop. Yeah, Colt's relationship with his mom has seemingly gotten in the way of his marriage to Vanessa. Okay. You raised me to be just a subservient person to you. And I just want to know why. Do you understand why I'm, I'm even mad? Do you even stand why I, I, I'm no. this way? I, I am 36 years old. Stop treating me like I'm a kid. Things get even more heated between the mother and son as Colt speaks up for himself. I, I shouldn't be bothered with your life. This is your life. It's not my responsibility in well, life. I'm to, moving out. It's not it my responsibility. You're not moving out. Where are you moving to? I wanna... I'm not going to do this. On, you know what? I'm not going to do this. Why are you doing this? What are you doing, Colt? What am I really oh, doing man. here? I just want to talk. I want to sit down, let's talk about things. You just run away. Backstage, Debbie continues ranting, but eventually returns to the stage where things continue to escalate. You, you can get the hell out. Oh, well. No, he can't, because I don't care anymore. Are you come here, I asked you to come here and support me. You come here and embarrass me and try, try, treat me like a shit. I'm no, done, dude, go. Me. You want to totally destroy me? Is that what you want? You're no. doing that. Then the tell-all takes an emotional turn as Vanessa and Colt open up about suffering a miscarriage. I, I didn't want to tell you at the time when I was driving out to San Diego, I didn't want to leave her. I mean, it happened. Nothing I could really do about it. Yeah. He took me to the emergency room in the middle of the night. And um, that was that. <laughs> I felt very heartbroken. I felt so bad for you. Vanessa blames herself for the loss of their baby, the stress she put on herself, but also the pressure that comes with living with Debbie under one roof. Vanessa, do you want to move back in with your husband? Didn't sign up for a part-time husband. In May, the couple's relationship was in a much better place. Colt finally proposed to Vanessa. We're engaged. We're engaged. Engaged, beautiful ring. Uh, you know, I love Vanessa. You know, she's a part of my life. She's my best friend. When E.T. spoke with the reality star just months before he popped the question, he got real about his feelings. <laughs> Vanessa, for, I don't know what it is about her, but we've connected in the past years. We've come in and out of each other's lives, but we just seem to always find each other again. So is there a chance these two could reconcile? Vanessa says one thing has to happen. Will you move back in if Debbie is not in the house? Yeah. 